Hello, hello. Am I live? It looks like I'm live. There we go. So, uh, if you missed the last stream, we beat the main story. And so now we're just going to do everything else. Uh, I think there's a lot of stuff in this world. So this one may be like a... Like maybe we go back and forth on this one. Like we don't do all of Mushroom Kingdom in one go. First moon of the night. Oh, right, the sheep ones take forever. So let's start with those. There must be some way to do these faster. And we'll go back for all these purple coins I see us passing once we get this. It just takes so long to get these dudes into that pen. Oh, right. We have to get all six to get a star. That's going to take time. Uh, tell you what, I see that sheep there, but let's go back and get all these purple coins I keep passing. Before I forget. I thought I could do that. I could not. <laughs> Let me see. Right. Probably a moon or star in this world. Speaking of stars, uh, 3D All Stars came out and I have it. I haven't played it yet. Uh, I probably will soon ish. Maybe on stream, maybe not. I don't know. I'm kind of thinking like this is taking up most of my. Or it's not taking up most of the time I would spend. I guess what I'm saying is I don't want to play two collectathon Mario games at the same time. And I am just habitually incapable of playing these without trying to collect everything. So rather than torture myself by doing two at the same time, uh, I'm thinking just kind of uh, keep going with this one and then... Maybe I'll play 3D All-Stars on stream at some point. Maybe I'll just play that in my own time. We'll see. Uh, but then again, I actually don't have a ton of time to play games outside of this stream sometimes. And by sometimes, I mean a lot of the time lately. Uh, it's basically all of the time I spend not playing games on this stream is working on that YouTube channel. Uh, which is still going to launch end of the month. Um, 
am I ready to set a date on that? I will on Wednesday's stream. So if you if you're watching now, tune in Wednesday's stream, and I will announce a like full date of like the channel will be up and whatever I have done by then. Uh, the third video is progressing a lot slower than I wanted it to, mainly because I I actually had to restart completely. Uh, because the game I wanted to cover would not run on my uh, current machine. <laughs> or it runs, but it doesn't run well enough to get usable footage while I'm recording. Uh, but I've picked another game that is really interesting to me, or at least I like it. Or I guess I should say I liked, I picked a sequel to a game where I really liked the first one. Oh, right. There's also all the acorn ones. Uh, I think my strategy is going to be get all of the, like, tedious moons out of the way right away. And, like, the ones that take time. Okay, boy. So I will continue to hold this acorn and in the meantime lead this dog around to hopefully find Let me see. I think it's somewhere up this hill. I mean the dog I don't know where the dog gets stars from. Yeah. Come on. I do feel like it's a... Oh, we're good. Uh, my capture card just blacked out my screen there for a second. If it happens a lot, I might have to fix that, but uh, for now, I'm not worried. Hold on, what's he finding? Come on, boy. Go get him. Uh, not a moon, but I'll take it. So many sheep. Okay. I need to get all of those. I'm actually glad I spotted those because I feel like those would be very annoying to find later. This little guy's gonna. There we go. Not that I needed that for anything, but you know. Come on, you must be able to find some moon. Oh, there's another sheep. And purple coins.
I'm gonna bring this dog back this way. I feel like I'm not crazy, right? Like, this guy always finds a moon somewhere. Let's see. What would be... Take that. Ooh. Is he finally going to find it? Not quite. if there's some more like not that I don't like the uh, subterranean theme but let me see if I've got a more appropriate song for this let's see I'd rather just have the world's music playing, even though there's no music right now. There we go. Jeez. Man, 
and these keep getting easy. At least that happened close to where it starts and not near the end. Oh, this little guy has so far to go. Oh, let me make a brief detour to throw this guy in here. Because I believe this is not one of the worlds where you can get one of those water dudes and make it go really fast. So I should get all of those going as soon as possible. saw that big bundle of coins, but I'd rather focus on making sure this sheep gets in his pen. Oh, come on, please. That's five. We've already found a lot more of the uh, purple coins than I thought I would. I thought they'd be a little harder to find. Okay, so there's the Goombet, I think would be her name. So where is the last sheep? I do want to save up and buy us a cool outfit from somewhere. I don't know where. him off the edge. There we go. Okay, I think that's probably the most tedious moon. Or star, I guess. Either or. On this world out of the way. Now let's try to focus a little more on purple coins, maybe? 
Or let's go do the uh Actually let's try and find the other uh acorns that get turned into uh who's a what's it? Uh how do I get up to Peach's castle there? Because I do see purple coins on it. I think I need to go inside Peach's castle to get on top of it. I'm not positive, but I think so. think where else these little golden dudes could be. And we're finding purple coins in the process, so it's a win-win. We're finding lots of purple coins in the process. I'm actually a little surprised that there aren't any, like, or I guess given the number of challenge rooms in this uh, world, I'm a little surprised at how many we're just finding out there. I'll take free money. If I were an acorn, where would I hide? There's lots of Goombas. Uh, maybe there's some in this little tunnel. No, but there are purple coins. Always nice to see. Okay, there's one more. Wait you! 
Oh, little buddy, please give me my hat back. Just 12 left. And I know for a fact three are on Peach's castle. There's probably more, actually, but uh, we won't know till we get in there. Where else could this thing be? I'm trying to think where I haven't looked. I didn't think I saw it back here. Yeah, it's not there. Uh, I don't think it's in, in or around. It might be around, but not in, like, not in Peach's castle anywhere. I haven't been up there yet. Maybe I should go down, or go up there. Purple coins. No acorn. Uh, I don't see one like in the water down there. We've been looking for these for so long that the first one hatched. Or bloomed, I guess? Hatched makes it sound like a weird alien creature thing. Tell you what. Since I cannot for the life of me find this last golden acorn, we're just gonna go into Peach's castle, and maybe it's somewhere up there. Because I think I've been around... Yeah, I've been here. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think of, is it might be... I might be remembering wrong, and it, it, it is... Uh, in uh, Peach's castle.
This is a little off topic, but I never played Captain Toad's Treasure. And from what I've heard, it's a very fun little puzzle game. And I liked those sections of, uh, the Wii U one, uh, 3D World. Yeah, I'm just going to go into Peach's Castle. Because uh, I think everything else we need is uh, somewhere in there, or I have to go in there first. Let's see what we got. Correctly, there's. Oh, no, not snapshot mode. There's like a first person mode, right? Hold on, let me check the controls. Wait, no, that's just gonna show me. Wait, controls. Reset camera. Wait, no, that's two players. Okay. So if I click in the right thumbstick. Yeah. Just like the old uh, N64 one. all the achievements. Uh, I may as well click through all the ones we have. We achieved world peace. I guess while I'm clicking through this, I'll just make small talk. Uh, this week, uh, I went down to the Trader Joe's and picked up all the seasonal stuff that's there. It's pretty good, y'all. Lots of pumpkin stuff. I had a pumpkin. I had a pumpkin bagel with pumpkin cream cheese this morning. It was pretty good. Also picked up some pumpkin brioche. Pumpkin ice cream. Uh, what else did we get? Uh, some like fall harvest pasta thing. Uh, a bunch of different kinds of butter, like a maple butter, a pumpkin butter, uh, an apple cider jam, which I love.
How many of these are there? Like, I'm just getting moons for getting moons now. God, these Toadette moons take so long. Trader Joe's pumpkin stuff. Pretty good. I feel like I'm forgetting a bunch of stuff that we picked up, but that's like the main stuff I remember. Uh, I've also still been working that nine to five. Still same as ever, still not really a nine to five, but that's just how salaried work goes, I guess. I feel like that's a thing they don't really prepare you for in uh, school. Like, they don't tell you that, uh, like, if you get a job that is set as, like, a salaried position, they will almost always get you to work overtime because they don't have to pay you for it. Uh, so that's your life lesson for today. Uh, Whatchamacallit. Uh, your life lesson is work sucks. Uh, so you may as well do whatever you want. Or I guess you could always do kind of what I'm doing, where I have the secure... Or, Secure as secure as a full time job ever is uh, in an at will employment environment. Uh, keep the secure job while you work on the stuff you actually want to do, but that takes a lot of time and doesn't work for everybody. Where is there? Should be another tile that's raised, right? sitting here scanning the floor forever. And if I keep it like real low to the ground, it'll be more obvious. There it is. God, there's still more. Okay. Come on. There it is. They're just gonna make me keep going, aren't they? I feel like I should be look up. Oh. That's sneaky. There we go. Sheesh. Okay, but there was no way up to that balcony there.
Do I need to drain the lake? I feel like I do. Let's drain the lake. So now that that's done, I think I need Yoshi to get that thing out of there. Where is Yoshi? I don't remember. Is he... I don't think he'd be at his house because that's like a separate area there. He says he's gone to Peach's castle. he saw him in the castle. Maybe there is something in the castle that I missed. Secret door somewhere. Oh, uh, we'll figure it out. There's got to be some way. Tell you what, for now, I know we can do this. Okay, so I saw those purple coins down there, but I think water destroys the Goombas, and I don't want to risk it. Hey, I'll take it.
You know what I could do? Uh, I could take this Goomba Tower and take it to the front of the castle and see if I can jump up using this. Like, let's try this. Uh, it might not work, but it's worth a try. Oh no, that definitely gets me up there. Yep, there's Yoshi. Let me just also make sure I've got these. So those purple coins down by the water are the last ones we need. May as well do this one since it's going to be hard to... Uh, if this leads to a star or if this is just like a way to get up there. Wow. Yeah, I think that's just a way up there. There's like two moons you can get for like eating all the fruit in the level or something like that. And now we can also do the uh, purple coin stuff. that fruit. But there's still more fruit in the level, so... Let's see if we can go for two. that's all the fruit from this area? Not positive. And I was right to be not positive, because there it is. I think since there's still more fruit, there's got to be a third, right? I guess let's keep going. Let's get all the fruit. I want to try to do all the Yoshi stuff kind of in one go here, if I can manage it. Yeah. 
Oh, we also still haven't found that other golden acorn. Trying to see where else these fruits might be. I should also try and build up coins because I want to buy costumes. Maybe there's just one extra fruit. I feel like it would be weird for me to be just totally missing a ton of it. So let's see, where else can I go? you what I'm just gonna say I got all the fruit stuff and hope there's not a third moon I'm just totally missing out on by ignoring it oh there we go I found some of it oh I wonder since that counted uh, the other pipe probably counts, too. Let me go do that. Let's see. I'm trying to think what other, like, current event stuff I can talk about while I do all this tedious stuff. Uh... Honestly, I don't know. I lead a pretty uh, boring life, I guess. So, let's see. Where was I going to go? Oh, right. It's down here. Oh, I hope that didn't reset everything. I think it did. I guess my question is, okay, so the fruits respawn. Oh, I'm going to have to go all the way back up there again. There's like one or two more. Yeah, I think it's just this guy. Oh, I lost my, uh, lost my six thing.
Okay. I think there were actually a few fruits on top of Peach's castle. So I think that... Uh... What's the word I'm looking for? So we got Yoshi again. Are there fruits here or did I imagine that? I may have imagined that. Yeah, I guess I must have imagined there being fruits up here. Oh, no, I did not. How will I get over there? I guess I can do it from here. Okay, good. His little, like, stomach meter didn't reset. So I don't have to go pick up a bunch that I already did. I feel like there's something I'm missing somehow. Like... Is there like a move guide specifically for Yoshi somewhere? Maybe I should look, try to find that because I feel like there must be something. I didn't know you could do that. Or I didn't remember I could do that anyway. So that's... Okay, that's all of Yoshi's stuff, I think. Aside from his little challenge room we found earlier, which we may as well do now. I'm also done with these guys, I'm pretty sure. We should have no reason to go back to... The Goombas, aside from the uh, challenge room that's over there, or to use Yoshi in the overworld again. Hmm. Gotta stay hydrated. depth perception on that one. I 
got I got frazzled there. Let's So that's the main room for this area, but I feel like there should be, like there's always two, right? I'm not crazy for thinking there's probably another one that I'm missing. is if I go like somehow like deep in the clouds here or something. a secret. There we go. Uh, let's see. So let's get out of here. Uh, yeah, I kind of don't know what to talk about other than, uh, I guess, what's going on in the game here. If anyone's in chat, how are you doing today? Uh, Oh, I did not mean to go back in there. Oh yeah, I forgot Cappy also tells you when you've gotten everything if you like leave and come back. That could be useful if we want to avoid paying money for Toad to show us some stuff. Let's do this one next. Oh, this is one of the boss refights. Uh, let's just get it out of the way. Let's do it. I forget if the bosses are actually harder or if these are just literally the same fights. I guess I'll find out. This 
boss is still so strange to me. Like, it feels so out of place. And there's no, like, exclamation or lore. Okay, so I, th I think that's harder than the original boss. Yeah, and I think you have less time for that. So these are harder. Or at least this one is. I don't think that little move where he throws the box up has changed, though. have this a little less than I thought. See you later, alligator. Yeah, we got all the costumes. Um, oh, there's so many I want. <laughs> uh, for now, let's focus on... I think I'll roll with the uh, 64 skins for a while. Keep it classic. Uh, I think I'll save up and then either start rolling with the 8-bit hat, the skeleton costume, or the sunshine outfit. It does feel a little like a ripoff, but I think they just recycled the uh, Cappy animation from like the default hat. Like they didn't give it a special like 64-bit one. 
I don't know. Maybe I wouldn't notice even if they did, but something would have been nice, like some extra thing. We're gonna have to go back out. Why are you still giving me travel tips at this point in the game? Like, I guess it's technically possible to have gotten here without knowing how to dive jump, but, like, come on. Okay, I think this was number one. And then, wasn't this number two? Then three? Oh, God, which was four? Was it you? Okay, the one by the door. Okay, that's going to be hard to remember. The one I hit last time is seven, and then the other one in the corner is eight. I might be wrong. Okay, so one. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. And then I think this one is seven. Yes, we did it. That took a lot of work. Okay, I think that's all I can do in here. Okay, let's see which boss refight is up here. This might actually be like a challenge room, but I'm pretty sure it's just a boss. Yep, it's the, uh, it's the one from, uh, the woodland place. My favorite kingdom. And I see those things in the corner, so that's how it's going to be more difficult. trigger those things back there. Come on. 
that's not what I wanted. Why am I having such a hard time with this? There we go. Okay, I think one more and then we're good. That's two bosses down? I don't think there's a Bowser refight, but I might be wrong. I think it's just each of the main kingdoms. I don't think I've ever actually seen this animation with the 64 skin on. I kind of like it. Nice one. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. Let's see what's in here, I forget. Oh, I do remember this one. I think to get the secret one too, you have to like bounce off the bullet bills for a while. Nice. Okay, we got the secret one. We can just focus on finishing this thing now. Oh god. Okay, at least we got that, uh... We got the bonus one. So we can focus on the rest. And we 
get so many coins from running through this that I'm not gonna like lose a bunch. bounce. We can do this. God. Oh, that was so close. This is some, like, galaxy stuff. jumped right into that. I'm disappointed in myself. Right at the end, too. Let's get it. Not a smart play. Uh, I'll be the first to admit it. mentioned I'm really bad at 2D Mario, because I am. Like, I feel like I'm pretty good with, like, 3D Mario, because it's all, like, spatial awareness, more... I mean, there's actual platforming, too, but, like, something about the way... 2D Mario works. My brain just can't wrap its head around. Okay. We got our health back. That's good. And we don't want to outrun uh, a little 
thing here. Please? Okay, we're good. Okay, we're back to this part. I will say, while I think this is still challenging, like really challenging, I do wish more worlds had like a really involved, hard, uh, like either 2D or le like just any section, I guess, like this. Like I feel like there's nothing else this difficult until you get to like darker side or darkest side, I think is technically the one. Secret 2D treasure. How is that one the secret one? Either way, we got it. Uh, next up, another boss room, I think. Which one is it this time? Ooh, this guy. First punch done. I wonder if I could have captured his hand in that one moment. Okay, no, you specifically have to do it after their legs done. a lot of stuff to keep track of. Okay. We got this. Now I know what to expect. Mario's got a mean left hook. So close. I'm just not getting it today. There we go. She 
Sheesh. Let me get some water. Okay, let's try this one more time. I'm a little surprised how difficult this is, actually. Because, like, I think the other bosses we've had so far, like, the change has been very slight, but somehow just adding the, uh, little skeleton dudes. Okay, you definitely cannot capture those. And I should stop trying to. Man, they are everywhere. I'm actually going to, like, lose out on a lot of coins here. I think it doesn't help that there are no health pickups, and you have to be so precise with oh, where the gloves land, and every time they hit the ground, those little dudes come back. That's hit number two. I need to be flawless on this last hit. Because I do not have the uh, stuff to spare. Did that not capture? I'm so mad. If I were not a considerate uh, neighbor and partner to the person I live with, I would be screaming right now. Okay, I think he's dead. Yeah. I'm kind of impressed with myself how fast I'm cleaning up this world.
So let's go back out here. Uh, oh, right. I think there's the, like, uh, tracing like, steps thing here. I think that's what this is. Oh, it's a race. There's going to be another one. got him. I was nervous for a bit there, but we got him. Is there a third one? I feel like there's a third one. Guess not. Alright. Uh, let's see what's the acorn I've been missing. I thought I checked down here, but uh, I guess I didn't. Oh, it sucks that I can't run though with this thing. This is going to take a while. Uh, as long as I'm just holding forward, let me get some more water because my throat is dry. <clears throat> Sorry, I hit the mic there. about this boss. No health pickups, so I'm just gonna have to fly solo here.
gotta take this slow and steady. I got one heart. Like, this one feels substantially harder than the original, because there's, like, two of them. It's just the whole boss twice. I hope their, like, entire back end doesn't reset. Yeah, that's good. Oh, did I only have to do that twice? I thought you had to hit them three times. I guess they broke tradition there. I'm so surprised I haven't found a moon rock on this world. I wonder if there isn't one. Let me see. How am I doing on moons? So one of those is the... Wow, I'm actually missing a lot still. Uh, a lot of them are just toadette moons, but still... Uh, I didn't realize how many moons were in this world. I mean, I know they all have a lot, but this one in particular has a lot. See how they made this one harder. but we can do this. I believe. Oh. I hate how we can just like, escape out of that, no problem. I feel like I'm actually doing this easier than I did the other time. Oh, he's dead. That was fast. <laughs> Let me know if the game is too loud or anything, by the way. I forget if I adjusted this for the Fall Guy stream I did this weekend or not. So the Elgato might be set uh, a little louder than normal. Or quieter, I'm not sure. I guess either way, let me know. Uh, I didn't 
think to check before the stream, which I probably should have. Okay, I think that's everything in this area. No, there's that, uh, that hut that probably also has a boss in it. Okay, this one. I remember this bird dude. Too. I'm having an easier time with the refights than I did the actual fights in the story. It's interesting that you only hit, uh, what's we call it? Like you hit some two times and some three times. I feel like there must be something I can do with these motorcycles, otherwise why would they be everywhere? But I don't know what they are. Oh, I was there. I think actually that they might be intending me to use the uh, motorcycle there. Okay, where was it? Here it is. I'm still gonna try to do it this way though. Yeah, that wasn't gonna happen. Okay. 
You win, game. I'll play it your way. There's another one, right? I think I remember seeing it. Yeah, up there. Oh. Well, this was like the easy way to get up to Yoshi, I guess, the whole time. I'd be lying if I said I didn't feel a bit stupid right now. Where have I not been? Been in there. Uh, I know there's the rocket. I think there's also one boss we haven't fought yet. Uh, I know there's the brutal refights on the, I think it's the darker side the moon and that's also where all those art ones are tell you what let's do this one I think it's this way. I'm going to be extra precise about this. That looks right. Mustache is too high, or the nose is too low. Because uh, this definitely goes right there. Actually, I think Mario has the thinner eyebrows. Or not thinner. I don't think that's the right word. Honestly, I think I've already scored more than 60 points, but I want to aim for as high a score as I can. Let's see how I did. Okay, 
So I'm going to try to remember the order might matter too. So let's try and do the mouth, eyes, and eyebrows first, then the mustache, then the nose. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> You monster toad, you took away all my reference points. You bastard. mustache being like about there I guess even if I fail this I will at least know for next time to not go relative to his visible facial features because those disappear I think I just put the nose directly on top of the mustache there I'm not a hundred percent sure I'm remembering this face being at more of an angle than it was. I think that was worse than last time. Yeah, uh, I had his face at more of an angle. Okay, this time let's try to remember. Okay, so where the ear shape and the hat shape come together, that's about where the point of the mustache lines up. That's where the center of the nose is and the curve of the mustache. And then the mouth, I'll call that like the middle of the ear. Uh, the eyes, the bottom of the eyes starts where the ear meets. I think I can actually go relative to the ear for most of this stuff. And then I can do the left eyebrow relative to where the like cuff of his glove starts. And then the other one I'm kind of going to have to guess blind. I rush it over. Okay, I'm going to call that his first eyebrow. I also need to remember his face is not at a super deep angle. This might be like all the way up on his hat, but I have no good reference. Actually, let me do the, I think this is the right eye. So let me do this one first. Like 
like right about there. I probably should not have started with the eyebrows. I should have started with stuff that would be easier to uh, place relative to stuff because it would make the rest of them easy to kind of figure out. That is a lower score than I got last time. So let me see where I went wrong at least. I think everything just needs to be down and to the right more. Okay. So the base of the mouth dips just below where his shoulders are. That could be a good reference point. Maybe more of the center of the peak of the mustache. And bring the mustache closer to the ear. I think that was my biggest mistake, was I didn't put stuff close enough to where the ear is. Oh, and the long side of the eyebrows go inward. on stuff that's going to be a little bit easier. Like, I guess, don't be afraid to get right up on there. Since I keep accident, or since I keep placing everything like, closer to the left side that I'm supposed to. I guess I should remember that that's Mario's arm on the left there, so his face is not as big as I think it is. I also just did the nose, but I'm pretty sure I should have done the eyes first so they would be underneath. I don't know if the game actually tracks that or not. I also can't tell if the like, big part of the eyes are supposed to be up or down. Oh god, where did I put the eyebrow? No, we'll call it there. That's better. Hey, we did it. Isn't there one where we do Bowser though? Maybe that's in a different world. Let me see if that garden moon's growing. It has. Oh, that's not what I want. Let's see. I'm missing 40, 41, 42, and 43. And then the rest are... Uh, 
Toadette Moons, which I can actually go claim some more. I guess before I go in and claim those Toadat ones, at least one of these is going to be the like found with X Kingdom art. It looks like we've done all the boss rematches. So yeah, let me go do Toadat, and then I will see what uh, the bird has to say. Oh, there's also going to be the moons for uh, seeing Princess Peach in every world. Uh, and we won't get hers from here until we do all the others. see what the bird whose name I keep forgetting has to say okay found with mushroom kingdom art okay I'm gonna guess the mushroom kingdom art one is the only one left so, let's turn these in. I do wish they still looked like stars. I'm kind of disappointed that they don't. question is do I want to do dark side now or do I want to go back and do some of the other kingdoms I feel like I may as well do dark side now there's like a million found with blank art uh, moons on that planet Okay, we have unlocked Darker Side. Uh, I'm going to save Darker Side for last. Because I feel like that's the, like... I feel like that's really meant to be the final moon. Like, if you play... If you play through it and you get to the end and there's the whole celebration, like, that's the end. As far as I'm concerned. So many rabbits.
That feels like an area where a secret should be. But I don't think there is. I think actually to get any like secret stuff to show up, we have to do the brutal refights first. So let's get down to it. Some of them more difficult. First one down. Which one is next? I think it might be the poison one. Shouldn't be too bad. Boss number two. I'm a little annoyed I took that one hit because that's gonna like snowball as the rest of these go on.
But that means... I think I'm gonna have to do... At l I mean, ideally I'll do all of them perfect from now on, but I'm gonna need to do at least one perfect to even get to the top. Oh, and then I think it's the like neck that you fight at the top too. I do like the Brutals theme song. actually might be the easiest one. I say as I take a hit, but I, I got too confident there. That's on me. I should have just let him go about his thing. Does it at least remember that I killed some, or is it going to make me do all of them again? Okay, I have to do the rest of the bosses perfect. I think we can do it. Because now I know... Well, I know the tricks for the next one. She should be easy now. And I think the poison guy, like, there's probably a trick to him, but I'm just going to let him go about his business when he's not doing the move that lets me attack him. Like, if I just focus on dodging, I don't need to do anything fancy. Okay, so that was not good. That was very bad even, I think you could say. But we've still got plenty of time. I'm still gonna, I'm gonna get this before the end of the stream. I'm calling my shot now.
I just need to be more careful. I can't keep, like, just skipping past these early fights just because I know what I'm doing. Like, with this one, it actually is good to, like, on the ground and uh, take care of those extra hats. We got this, we got this. I'm just gonna have to play even more conservative on the next few fights. If I remember correctly, there is health before the uh, neck fight, but I might be wrong. Okay, with this boss, I'm just gonna, like, only go for it if the shot is perfect. Like that. actually seen that move finish. Okay, we play it safe and we win this thing. I'm gonna learn my lesson on the next few fights. Uh, I should keep getting these coins. I should also bear in mind, we will need a lot of coins. What I may do is, rather than buy the skeleton outfit or anything like that, I will hoard my coins until it's time to do darker side, or until I hit cap and I am actively wasting money by uh, not spending it. I remember to get the 999 stars. I think I'm just gonna keep cleaning up his poison so I have somewhere to stay. Oh, no. 
no! <laughs> well, now I know he covers the whole floor on his last one. So what I should do on that last hit, and I'm gonna have to remember to do it, is leave Cappy out uh, to clear a spot for me, and then jump. Enough that I can do that part. Rather we fail early than fail late. I'm gonna charge my phone over here because it's drain and battery. Okay. It's been about 10 minutes, I think since I made my prediction that we would get this done in this stream, and I still feel confident in that. I was hoping we could do this world and one of the smaller ones, like the Cloud Kingdom or whatever, but I am less so confident in being able to do that. I think this may turn into just... That's a pain in my butt. I think the best practice with this boss might just be to like try and spam him down until that last phase. Okay, I am somehow getting worse at this as time goes on. I think I'm like overthinking this first one. I just gotta focus on dodging and not think. Oh, <laughs> 
Okay. I am definitely, like, actively getting worse at this fight. Okay, we at least got past this guy this time. And I feel like I can do the second one pretty reliably. I'm gonna take back those coins he's been taking from me. After doing like a darker side and everything, I needed most of a like full stack of coins to Was honestly riskier than I probably should have done. This fight done, I feel like I've got her down. The real challenge is going to be doing the next... I feel like the next one I know what I have to do. I just have to do it, which has been a problem for me so far. Uh, but then the fourth one, I don't know how his fight has changed, so that's going to be like a total wild card. Honestly, he might knock me out just from me not knowing whatever his new gimmick is. Or, like, his gimmick's gonna be the same, but, like, his new version of it. And then hopefully I can heal before the mech fight. Okay. So, yeah. I did just confirm that leaving Cappy out in front of him... Probably hitting this guy more than I should be, like I should be just focused on dodging. Okay. Sir Nightgaunt, welcome to the stream. You're just in time to watch me have a panic attack. <laughs> That's three down, one to go. 
And then I hope I can heal at the top, because there's no way I'm going to get through that fight. So I have not seen this refight yet. This is the furthest I've made it. So I don't know what this guy's gimmick is going to be this time. If it's even going to be different. First round is normal so far. Don't mind that. Okay. So we're gonna do the whole thing again. Again. Mario voice, isn't it like, like Boo is just someone's voice sped up, and then I think Bowser's just someone slowed down, like they must have done something like that. So far so good. This will be the true test, because I have yet to get past this part of the fight without taking at least one hit of damage. Okay, there's the one hit, but no more. Take some time to clear out these. I've already put out there. Yeah, that's a smart thing to do. There we go. One down. Pretty good on this second one. Like, I think the last three times I've gotten to her, I haven't taken a single hit. So I'm confident here.
All right, two down. Yeah, I'm feeling confident because I know what to do. I know what to do for the next guy. And then I feel like with two health, I should be able to figure out the fourth guy. I might not be able to do him perfect, but I can at least uh, avoid whatever is like harder stuff is going to be. I feel like there's a way to make this part uh, end sooner, but I don't know what it is, and every time I try to mess with him here, I just make more trouble for myself. My palms are so sweaty. I feel like I need, like, like in boxing, or at least in movies about boxing, there's always that guy, like, standing in the corner of the ring with, like, a towel, a towel and a water bottle. I feel like I need that right now. Okay, moment of truth. Okay. So that's just like it normally is. Honestly, I think I should just hop around and not try to stop this and do anything to it. Okay, so he's gonna be throwing them sideways. Oh, that's smart. This is too easy. You know what? I'll take it. And then I think there's that like giant mech they had in Bowser's world. I think I have to fight that. And then I think I'm done with this. Okay, they give me one heart before the uh, boss fight. Is there like a secret back here? There is. Take a pity heart, because 
I had a lot of trouble with this one when it was in the story mode, and it's probably going to be harder this time. Interesting. They're giving me a hammer throw this time. So I wonder if it's not going to be what it was before. they just gave you that bird thing but didn't really have any like a normal attack to deal with this thing you just had to like uh, wait for your opening versus him. God, no. I think that did just unlock a bunch of smaller moons on this world, though. Whoa, is that just an outfit I unlocked? Cool. Uh, so I should actually sign off because uh, it's past 10 and I don't want to, I don't want to keep the uh, person I live with uh, up too late and I actually should get some sleep because I've got a doctor's appointment early in the morning. So thank you for stopping by Sir Night Gaunt. Uh, I guess usual plugs, Twitch, Twitter, follow me. It really helps out. Share the streams, share anything. Uh, 
on whoop by Wednesday night stream, I will have, I will hopefully have like a definitive release date set for my YouTube channel. Uh, if you missed earlier in the stream, uh, I had to scrap the video I was working on because my computer could not handle playing a game and recording at the same time. Uh, so I'm still working on that. But uh, yeah, Wednesday I'll have a thing, a release date set. Yeah. But yeah, uh, good night. I will see you on Wednesday.